Hey beauties, welcome to my channel, or welcome back. I can't remember what she says, but you guys, this video, I blame Mel Thompson a thousand percent. She has made me realize my full potential in life is to acquire Tom Ford quads. Duh. I'm just kidding. But I, I don't know what I was doing with this. How did I end up buying this? I don't know. I think Mel talks about Tom Ford quads and I was like, you know what? I need a Tom Ford quad. And then they announced that they were doing one more round of the Sephora sale. So I took it as a sign that I needed a Tom Ford quad and I picked this one up and then God blessed me. The makeup gods were like, Karen needs more than one. And so then we got that $25 off a $75 purchase and I took it as a sign because there was one quad that sold out during the third round of the VIB sale. So I couldn't get it because it was in my cart when I went to sleep and when I woke up it was sold out. So I was like, fuck. Anyway, got my paws on it. And I was so mad because I literally set my alarm for 2 a.m. Central Time for when the Sephora sale went live. And I think they had a glitch with their coupon. Anyway, it was showing that this product was sold out. And so I was like really pissed because I was like, this is the only thing I want from the Sephora sale. And then I think I had a like a notify me um, alert on this and then I got the alert and I used my coupon and it all worked out. And so I was also able to get a second quad and it's African Violet. So the first one I picked up is Photosynthesex and I got African Violet too. So I feel like a bougie bitch. I got two Tom Ford quads. Clearly I'm excited for my 30th birthday. That's what I'm blaming all of this on. But also guys, I did decide to kind of go on a no buy this month. So we'll see how long that lasts. So far, so good. I did give myself a few exceptions, like the Paulina palette and maybe the Becky G palette. I don't know. Anyway, let's swatch this one first. Oh my gosh, you guys, these are so fancy. Like I just, I don't, I just don't know what to do with myself. And I think that I didn't expect them to be this big. Oh shit. <laughs> I'm already breaking stuff. So there's like little free brushes that come with it. But yeah, I was not expecting this to be big. I just assumed that they would be smaller than this, but they're, you get a pretty decent size pan. So let me go ahead and swatch. Oh my God, I'm so excited. Oh my God. Oh my God. <laughs> Okay, I don't know if I'm ready for this. Ooh, it's soft. Mm-mm. Ooh, pretty, 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 pretty. Pretty, 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 pretty. Oh, <laughs> fingers are getting a little wild there. I did feature this, now I'm remembering. I featured this in my green palette collection video, but I haven't actually used this on my eyes yet. This is my first time swatching it. So very subtle, but also not really, because I matched it, it's washed pretty well. Uh, I don't know what to say about the formula yet, because like I said, this is my first time playing with these, but here are the four shades from the Photosynthesex Squad. Gorgeous. And now we're going to do African Violet. I can't even believe this. <laughs> I literally can't believe it. Okay. I haven't seen this one yet, because I literally just opened this box. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Oh my god, so pretty. Are you serious? And these are like heavy, like they feel really nice. You guys, I feel like the makeup haters are gonna come at me with these, but I don't care. They're so pretty. If I don't like it, I will let you know. This purple shade really like called to me. It's like a, it's like a satin. Ooh. This one is like a topper. Okay, okay, I see you. So there's those four shades. Let's just swat, oh pretty, oh my gosh. You guys, are you kidding me right now? I know they don't swatch like a whole lot, but I feel like that's the vibe that Tom Ford has. It's like very subtle, very grown up, very expensive. Like if you really look at, you know, people like celebrities, they don't really wear the amount of makeup YouTubers and Instagrammers wear. So keep that in mind. I'm so pumped to play with these and I will give you a full report once I have my thoughts situated in my head. So I hope you enjoyed my little 
bougie Tom Ford swatch party. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed. Let me know what luxury makeup you guys have tried because I'm so curious to hear. And I will catch you in my next video. Bye, guys.